Galatians 5th chapter verse 1, stand fast, therefore in liberty where Christ has made us free, and being entangled again with the yoke of bondage, being entangled again with the yoke of bondage. Another form of slavery that nobody talking about is another form of slavery nobody talk about. No one, no one talking about the NBA trade and buy out clause. If one buy you out, you're not wanted anymore. This is a form of slavery. Number two, no one talk about the NFL trade and buy out clause. This is a form of slavery. When you get injured, and you're not playing the way they want you to play, they either trade you or buy you out. Number three, some goes for base, so same goes for baseball game. They trade players and buy them out. Four, some goes for hockey players. Trade it, if it does not play good for this team, they will trade you to another team. Five, soccers, the same way if you, you get hurt and your ability have changed, they will trade or buy you out your contract immediately. Number six, there are another trade and going on in stock market where people buy and sell stocks. But it's not human beings, but they buy stocks and barns. Number seven, another form of slavery is your credit card working excessively, excessively just to pay off your master, which is the credit card, which is the rich. The Bible says, don't the rich men oppress us? Number eight, just like sexual sin of homosexuality and lesbianism, another form of active to sexual promiscuity. You become a slave to sex, and sex become a slave to you. Number nine, just get married and divorce. And you can tell the same cycle, often get married, often get divorced. And the Bible say, the heart of your heart, you put away your spouse. But but in Galatians, in uh, Malachi, it say, I hate putting away. Number 10, if you are not a Christian, hear me out now. If you're not a Christian, you are a slave to your flesh, which is selfishness. You are a slave to secularism, which is of the world, as mentioned in 1 John 2, 16 and 17. Read it for yourself. And the last but not least, you are a slave to Satan, which we are, you are a slave to Satan, the God of the earth, temporarily until Jesus Christ returns to earth and binds Satan a thousand years, then loose him. What I'm saying to you is watching this video, my friend. Another form of slavery is when the NBA and uh, football, uh, NFL, and soccer league buy players, trade players. That is a form of slavery. So a lot of people think that slavery have ended. No, slavery is still going on. And if you are not a Christian, you are slave to Satan. You are slave to your flesh, your sin. You are slave to secularism, which is the word of Bible. Say, love not the world, neither things that are in the world, also the world. The lust of the flesh, the crave of the eye, and a pride. They have pride week in, in June where LGBTQ letting go God's principle would question. So another form of slavery is NBA, NFL, soccer, and baseball games. These are people that buy and trade players. So don't tell me that slavery has ended. Slavery has not ended. It's another form of manipulation, of trading, and buying out players. Unto them, my friend, be free today and stop being in the trade market. Look, and I'm gonna say for closing, it's amazing how young people are dying. They end up missing. They end up missing. People buying organs, people buying brains, people buying all these things. Why? Because they want to uh, uh, buy body parts for sale. That's why I'm not a donor, my friend. So this is another form of slavery when you buy and sell, when you buy and buy out players for another team.
or the person. If you're not good enough, they buy you out and give you the money. And you're not, no, you're not playing the NBA, NFL, or soccer league anymore. Until then, my friend, my God bless you richly. It's my prayer. Peace.